Showtime! Hello everyone, Edo here. And Suyoi. And we're back. A Gundam tale. Turn 43. Turn 43. Turn 43. Gotta figure it out. Oh, that's bad. That's really bad. Oh, no, needs way more help than that. Wait. Huh? Yes? Yeah. What items do I have? Ooh. Could work. Could work. Could work. Would work. Should work. Will get me later, but it would be worth it. I really hope that counts as a physical move. Because I'm using Barrier Field. What are you using it on? Uh, Sonic Boom and Baku Netsuken. Hmm. Okay. So, anyways. Continuing on from the conversation we had last time. Yes. Uh, more or less, uh, see. sum up. It, is a it does! Hmm. It is a creature that can physically change its form. What? Oh, Fritz, you're really fucking weak. <laughs> you know, be committing a homosexual act if it was normally one gender, but then switch to the other gender to have intercourse with someone of the gender it was usually at. And we gave our various reasonings uh, for why we entered the way we did in the previous episode. But then, here comes the follow-up to that. Okay. Somewhat, uh, you know, a similar scenario. Let's say that you have a succubus that's able to completely transform her saint. And so she transformed into a dude and seduced another woman. Uh-huh. Would that be gay? Just some really tough questions, huh? Why is Ono so slow? It's because I removed the wings! Motherfucker! Okay, uh... I would stand by it's the same. Wait, are you saying is it what, what would it be? Uh, would it be gay? No, it'd be lesbian. That's the same thing. No, it's not. How's that not the same thing? LGBT. Lesbian, gay, bi, and trans. So, so by their own group's admission, lesbian and gay are not the same thing. Otherwise, why wouldn't it just be gay, gay, bi, and trans? Or lesbian. Well, it can't be lesbian by entrance because that's very specific. Gay is all encompassing, but apparently lesbian specific. I don't know. But they're clearly separate things, or why would they be there like that? So, no, it's not gay, it's lesbians. It's lesbians. <laughs> it's not gay, it's lesbians. <laughs> okay. Wait, 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 wait. Does the woman know? No. Then it's not gay for her. Okay, she is exempt from the gay because she doesn't know. She doesn't know. Okay. I didn't know. But the succubus... She is, knows. Uh... She's very lesbians. But I don't think she would care. <laughs> she is a succubus. I see. Would it matter if she is bisexual by nature? Who, the succubus? Yes. No? Still lesbians. Mm. In this instance. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, Even she's though a guy she, now? yeah, she physically transformed into a guy. And again, like I said before, only a little. Okay, it's only a little lesbian. It's only a little lesbian because she is attracted to this woman. Mm -hmm. And she has the brain of woman. Well, she has the brain of succubus. I can't really say what that is. Okay. They're about to use full charge after, in not this next turn, but the turn after this next turn. Hmm. Wait. Let's see, I see. So then, what would you classify it? Wait, they're doing it now? That's ahead of schedule. They were supposed to do another ultimate weapon in Shin Hashoken by what Ray sent me. Hmm. Ray, you fucked up or something, I don't know. However, this counts as a free turn. So... 
break, dart, break, dart, break, dart, break, dart. Hey! Everybody give me a free turn. Everybody give me a free turn. No, we need you up. Unless they just suddenly did some other technique that I don't expect. <laughs> it's like, oh yeah, they're both using Fin Funnel. Fuck you! I would laugh if this killed him. I will laugh if this kills him. 6,222. Oh wow, that's not good. Maybe now they're gonna do the Shin Hashoken? Yeah, it does say that that's the next big thing. It's... Hmm. Okay. You're at the very least two thirds of the way of killing. Thing. At the very least, you haven't kept up with all the damage. According but, to you. Well, I thought you said you've been sort of keeping up with it. Yeah. I haven't been pinpoint paying attention, but I think I've been like noting down every time you've actually done damage to it. Two out of three, but it hasn't seemed to matter in this last bit. Okay. So, another question. What would you consider uh, it? Hmm. Worst part is I don't know what you guys are gonna do right now. It says Sonic Boom and Baku Netsuken. So that's pretty damn obvious. Okay. So, what would you consider it? If two sexless beings were to have intercourse with each other? Very weird because they wouldn't have any genitalia. Mm -hmm. uh, I would be very interested in watching that. <laughs> uh, <laughs> now I'm just imagining two robots with no... It's like R2-D2 and another R2-D2 is like... Beep, burr, beep, burr, just smashing into each other. Feels <laughs> <Here was> one. <coughs> oh, uh, you mean like yeah. ro weird robot sex? Where, like, two of them just, like, extend USB cables and plug into each other. They're like, woo! <laughs> yeah! I don't know. I don't well, know what I consider that. Well, I was thinking more along the lines of, like, you know, aliens, uh, like, holding up hands and, like, uh, touching fingertips. And, like, uh, that was enough to make the transfer complete. So, can. So, it's gonna. Supposedly, I will think it's gonna loop around. Like Boom and Baku Nets can mean that next turn is just going to be Arm Sniper Counter Zone, which is just fucking fine. So I should just block it. Okay, uh, I couldn't call it either or because I wouldn't see any that there'd be any attraction based on such things. There, there's no sex, so it would just be. No, well, that is sex. No, no, no sex. You said there would be no sex. No, they Sexless have. Being. Yeah, they have no genit, like I tell you, to just, uh, distinguish male or female, but that is considered the active intercourse for them. No, 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 that's what I meant by no sex, as in sexless beings. <laughs> as in they themselves have no sex. Male nor female existing, like, biology. <laughs> this is arm snipe and counter zone. And all of this, okay. Arm snipe and counter zone. So then I need... Obviously, Ono is no longer the fast healer he used to be. I need to accept this as fact now. So instead, Aeon, you are now the, the de facto healer. Uh, so you're saying you classify it as neither? Or none? Uh, I don't know. What'd you say you classify it, would it as? You mean neither gay nor straight. Yeah. You mean like gems? Fusion, but kind of not really, sort of. Yeah, I guess that's one way to look at it. Jesus but then goodness. again, like, uh, gems, I feel, would possibly uh, be able to classify under this other subject. Okay. How would you feel about, uh, you know, what would you classify beings that had both genitalia? That's just good old-fashioned uh, Japanese anime. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I see. You classify it as anime. <laughs> Only in anime! <laughs> I can't think of anywhere else it happened. Hmm. So I'm interested to know that snails are anime. They can be. 
I feel like a fact like that'll pretty much only come up in anime. That snails have both forms of genitalia? Yes. I feel like that is a random... Like, I could imagine that being just explained in JoJo's for no reason. Other than it probably has something to do with something. So basically, with the reason. <laughs> Wasn't there a guy with a stand that turned people into snails? Yes. Yes, there was. It was Heavy Weather. Owned by Weather Report. A rainbow appears, and anyone who gazes upon it turns to snails. Or any of its presence turned to snails, I think. I only barely now, just recently, understood the reasoning why. Mm -hmm. Want me to fill you in on that one? Yeah, sure. Well, when rain is done, what happens? Rainbow. What happens during the rain and after the rain? An influx of snails come out because it's moist. Like worms. They're more active in the water. So, I think that what weather, Heavy Weather and Weather Report's doing is that it's like it creates the effect and then has to force the after effect of snails everywhere. Like, it goes to that level of, like, weird bullshit. Just like how it can make it rain frogs just because that's a phenomena somewhere in the world. Mm. When most people I know wouldn't even really categorize that as weather. It's just a weird, freaky shit that happens where frogs get thrown by, like, tornadoes or some shit. Let's see, that was the... Okay, so this is gonna be Beamfield and Deadly Assault. It's been a while since it's been Beamfields and Deadly Assaults. Huh. So if it can cause any weather from up... No, no. From up, am I? Wait, Beamfield. Ah, fuck! So, wouldn't that mean that it could create acid ring? Yes. Yes, it could. I'm wondering why I can't do space weather. Horrifying space weather. <laughs> so, what does that mean? It could literally cause a meteor shower on an uh, area? Uh, maybe! <laughs> that would be great! Then again, I do kind of like the idea that like uh, there's an area it needs to destroy, and it just removes the ozone around that area. Let the sun do its work. Could it cause a solar flare? I don't know. Maybe, probably. A uh, solar flare that reached the Earth would do way more than just destroy a small little area. Yeah. Hmm. I wouldn't think that would be a good idea. Hmm. But Assassin's Creed certainly didn't think it was a good idea. Hmm. Okay, so according to you, Snails and plants are sexually categorized as anime. <laughs> <laughs> yeah! <laughs> you fucking know it! Hmm. Wait. So wait. Question. Uh -huh. Do we- what do we categorize snails as then? Do we categorize them as- do we have male-female categorizations for snails? I believe we just call them hermaphrodites. However, in essence, they are the same. They're all the same sex. Yeah. Therefore, gay. <laughs> but wait, uh, they have both genitalia. Gay. Not lesbian. Same sex. Same sex. Gay. But not lesbian. Wait. Do do snails? They have both. Wait, they have both what though? Both genitalia. For males and females. Yes. But. They don't have males and females, so it really isn't both genitalia for males and females. It's just two different sets of genitalia. Ah, but they have the genitalia for what we would consider female and a genitalia for what we would consider male. Oh. The the, the, the hole and the not hole. Yeah. Okay. Huh. Just like flowers. Gay. <laughs> so, really? Why gay and not... Same sex. Lesbian. You know what, lesbian, because it's hotter. <laughs> Futanari lesbians. <laughs> Thus, I turn back to anime. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so, not gay, anime. Gay, anime. <laughs> Very well. Hmm. I wonder if that's a choice you can pick in South Park. 
<laughs> yeah. Did you ever play that game? No. Um... I thought we were going to do it for the channel. I wasn't sure. Oh. Because, uh, you know, you and Ray did the other one. Hmm. Right. Right. Okay. I don't mind playing it for the channel. I mean, you're only doing one playthrough with Ray right now, right? Yeah. Digimon. So you could totally do another one. Yep. Could totally do another one. Totally do another one. Basically, this whole double shield strategy, like. I did have backup plan if it didn't work out, and, you know, that's been working out so far is the uh, backup plans when it doesn't work. And when it does work, it works, so, you know, hooray. It's a good strategy, this double shield. Y'all had to use it too, didn't you? I did. I don't remember if Ray I used it, though. But y'all used like, it and I think Vargas? Did. Yeah, I also used Vargas. Oh, yes. Uh, Are you still. Motherfuckers. Why? Why do you keep doing this to me? Are you still proud of that? That you've been able to like uh, keep Vargas out of the club? Yeah, fuck him. <laughs> no. <laughs> Let's see, your arm snipe's about to come out. We don't need you, but hmm, well, there's nothing we really need to do right now other than fully revive. What's his face? So you know what? Actually, what I could have done, probably should have done, I think, hmm, don't have a forge, right? Bring someone else in, who will definitely be slower. Hmm. Uh, fuck, that sucks. Fuck, that sucks with a duck. Ah! <laughs> Very well then. Okay. Well, I do got some other news uh, I can uh, go on about. Uh huh. A uh, little bit of a uh, look ahead into the future. And uh, that is that I've recently gotten into emulation. Oh no! Who are you emulating? Hmm? Who's your hero? <laughs> Uh, I mean, uh, console emulation. <gasps> right. Because, uh, you know, there's some uh, games I wanted to play, uh, PlayStation specifically for the channel. But, like, no matter what I did, I just could not get my recording device to record them. Like, so very annoying. Had everything set up, everything ready to go. And it just wouldn't record them. And I even went and I tried to use it. Well, maybe it's something about the PlayStation. Maybe the PlayStation just cannot display or something like that. <laughs> yeah, maybe the PlayStation just could not display properly or something was going on there. Oh, it was 900? Yep. He should be dead, <laughs> says your calculations. Nah. He's only like around 74,000 in damage. No, out of 90,000. So, you're on your way. But, uh... Right, uh, I tried uh, placing uh, PlayStation games inside PS... Uh, my PlayStation 2 that I got. And... It just would not display the game. All I did was scream at you. <laughs> not even then. Like, it actually played the uh, the Sony PlayStation original intro, and immediately afterwards, the screen went black. Oh. Wait, original PlayStation games? Yeah. Like what? Uh, specifically, Final Fantasy VII. Oh, yeah, that was an original uh, PlayStation game. Mm -hmm. I was, for some reason, I started thinking it was PS2. Yeah. Uh, you know, I had plans of uh, involving that game for a channel. Oh, yeah, we and do. so, like, I was getting that stuff together. I was like, okay, it's time to bust out the PlayStation. Does it still play? Well, it turns on. Okay, uh, does it still work? Seems to work. 
but the game just would not display. I was like, well, okay, I'll try PS2. Uh, it worked all the way up until actually playing the game, at which point it just gave me a black screen. So I was like, what the hell? What's up with that? <laughs> I mean, you know, nothing wrong with like uh, the PS2 uh, that I have. We're playing that right now. Yeah. yeah, at which point I was like uh, doing some major consideration of um, uh, getting the game on like uh, PlayStation Network because I believe it is available via that way. Uh, but uh, something came up. I forget exactly what. Oh yeah, now I remember. Uh, Final Fantasy VII is an RPG. And even though I do have plans of doing things differently compared to how we did this playthrough, like it, it's still an RPG you know I want to try to like uh, cut some stuff out so like I wanted a way to allow us to use cheats that allow us to game shark our way through it mm -hmm. and to my understanding uh, emulation on the computer actually has that because not only do they emulate the games they emulate the cheat devices that were released at the time so looked into it got a hold of hmm? what's up doesn't work out. Ooh, ooh, that doesn't work out. I might have to use uh, the, the the technique. The technique. The technique. Hmm. Well, you can't have Tremmy with you. Yeah, that's the problem. Okay. Let's say hypothetically, I don't have Tremmy with me. Who else is slow? Wait, well, yeah, I'm slow enough now. <laughs> yep. There's Ono and Fritz. Fritz is not slow. Um, yeah, doesn't he go after those two go? No. But that's fine. Aeon's slow. Mm. He's gonna do deadly assault. Actually, that means he's only gonna kill one guy. Right. So, I looked into emulation uh, techniques. I got two different emulators. One that was something of a standalone, and another one that involves a whole bunch of setup. But unfortunately for me, the only one that actually allowed for cheat devices to be used was the one that allowed for a whole bunch of different setup. So, you know, guess which one I had to go with? Yes, not the standalone one. Mm. So, I uh, got that set up and I actually managed to get the emulation running. It was like, okay, my copy of Final Fantasy VII is playing on my computer. Yeah. <laughs> right. And then came the next problem. How do I record stuff off of my computer? Because, like, my device gear and setup is uh, geared towards actually getting things off of consoles and things like that. I haven't figured out the computer aspect until recently, sort of, thanks to Ray's help. Like, um... Oh no, it's me! I didn't even use counter zone! <laughs> Hilarious. <laughs> right. So, uh, through some rigor mo, I found out a way to how to transfer my screen to my TV via from my computer and run that through the recording device that I normally use. Oh boy. So, it's uh, quite a bit of setup. Some, like, uh, long wires uh, running, like, uh, here and there. Not nearly as cumbersome as the setup I had uh, for the Vita recordings that we did for the Fate game. But, hmm. yeah. yeah. But uh, still, like, a, a little bit involved. I'm so glad Double Shield has priority. Yeah. God, imagine if it did not. <laughs> you know, uh, it does involve a lot more rigmarole when it comes to setting up my computer, though. To make sure I have everything uh, running through the screens correctly and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, me and Ray actually did a test recording uh, to see if it was working properly. You know, a quick little, like, 15-minute little tester of Final Fantasy VII to see if it recorded properly. And, um, despite all the th bad things that happened, it is mostly working. Like, uh, the picture came out, uh, good. Like, it looked a little bit off on the TV, but it was fine. Uh, once I ran it through the handbrake program that I usually use for my recording, 
Like a uh, picture came out like a uh, normal, what you would expect quality. Yeah, you bastard! And like uh, the uh, our audio recording was uh, being picked up fairly nicely uh, via vo vocal voices, uh, which I was uh, kind of concerned on because you know I was running the emulator through my computer, but that's what I used to record our audio. So you know, a big concern was could I do both? Would that be like a major strain on the computer or not? But uh, luckily, the computer is able to handle it, and the audio came out fine. And overall, there is only one problem, mm -hmm. and that was, no matter what I did, I was not able to salvage the actual in-game audio. Huh. Yep. It was really weird how the video recording, like, handled it. Like, there was a point to where there was sound and stuff like that, mm -hmm. but then it just completely went away. There was no more sound at all in the uh, video recording that was taken. But I think that's fine. I uh, just need to do a few more test recordings to be able to confirm it. But one of the problems that happened was that um, when we were setting up to record, one of the things I forgot to do was to uh, run the sound through my speakers. Hmm. Like uh, my, my uh, television speakers. Uh, because like the sound would come through the computer uh, no problem but, but that's not what we wanted we wanted the sound to come through the TV oh. because otherwise I'd figure the recording device wouldn't uh, pick up the sound and it seems I was kind of right on that front it's just that like uh, it was picking up sound earlier but then once I made the switch to force it to go through the TV that's when all sound just uh, went away so kind of hoping that the situation is that when I set up, when I get ready to record PlayStation... Jesus, this takes forever! <laughs> ...that I will, like, uh, finally have a good game sound, good game picture, good audio, and I uh, will have access to all the vast resources that GameShark allows for one to have. 6,500 and dead! So, it's just ultimate weapon this turn. Mm -hmm. Ah, okay. According to my notes, you did 84,700 damage. Okay, so there was a bit of miscount, but meh. A little bit of discrepancy. I probably missed one... Uh, Gatling fire. But, you know, it seems uh, well enough. One really good Gatling fire. <laughs> but wasn't the really good ones doing in the 10,000s? No, I never did 10,000 damage. I didn't know you could do over 9,999. Uh, the best one I did was like 7,600, 7,900. Hmm. This is gonna be Sonic Boom. I honestly am. No, I gotta play defensively. I cannot be stupid. <laughs> that would be the worst thing for me to do. Okay. But, as I was saying, uh -huh. like, uh, hopefully everything uh, should be recording correctly. Oh, and, uh, did I tell you that Ray managed to get that one thing working that you really want to do for Final Fantasy VII for some reason? Yes, you did. <laughs> Don't spoil it. That... Okay. That uh, won't do that. I probably will be throwing up the test recording, though. I do have a question about it. Yeah. Won't you have to do something for the borders? What do you mean? It's gonna be arm snipe. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Wait a minute. Okay. Uh, like, like with Gundam, how you do a thing for the borders. Uh huh. Yeah, that's what I mean. Are you, you're gonna have to do something like that? Yes, I am gonna have to come up with some borders uh, for uh, the, yeah, for that. That's so all I need right in the next mm -hmm. couple turns. Yeah. Of course, like I didn't really do that for the test recording. You know, the test recording was just the test recording. I just used the borders I used for um, Gundam. 
Yeah, I figure if those came out through, then whatever borders like I come up with in the future should be like fine. Right. Yep. Is that all you had to ask about it? Yeah, that's that's all the only question I had. Okay. So yes, that's something to look forward to in the far future. Far, far future. You know, like, we have other stuff planned before we get anywhere close to uh, getting that thing recorded. But still, it's a work uh, in progress. Look it's... forward to it. Yeah, look forward to it. Okay, so I've dealt about 10,000 to you. <laughs> That's like one-ninth of your health immediately, first turn. And I'm going to be able to keep doing it, bitch. <laughs> You're going to Mega Blast. The other one did shoulder pad shit, and you always pull out a gun, so you're using lasers. Unless you switch it up. Hmm. I don't know that he doesn't switch it up. Ah. So but, I guess best to be safe. Use both. But we'll have to find out if he switches it up in the next episode. Shit!